bleeds in printing at least is what we call it when the ink goes to the edge of the printed piece. And now that you know what a bleed is, you'll notice that a lot of things are printed with bleeds. So here's a few examples. These are my notepads. They've got a small bleed here at the top. Even my note cards, they have a lot of white space on them, but you'll notice there is a small bleed here on the one edge. These are mail pieces that go out. They've got a bleed on all four edges, or we call that a full bleed. Now the way bleeds are produced, printers cannot usually print ink to the edge of a sheet, at least not without making a big mess. And we usually print a lot of pieces up on a larger sheet for economics. So the way we set up bleeds is we set up files with extra space or extra ink if they're supposed to bleed and then we put these crop marks on there to, to tell us where to cut those down. And so this second image here shows, you know, the imaginary cut lines. We've actually shown the cut lines on here. So everything outside of these cut lines will be trimmed off. And what you end up with in real life, once it's all trimmed, is a nice proper card with a bleed.